Hello, family. Welcome back to the Ebony Odyssey. My name is Jermaine Golong. And I am Sharmnichi Long. And we are servants of the Most High God. I appreciate you for coming along. And as always, enjoy the journey. Today is a Taste Talk episode. Uh, we are reviewing Stone Town's wonderful Clay Pot Restaurant. Yes, this is an Indian restaurant mm -hmm. uh dealing in a lot of spicy type food <laughs> uh things that my wife definitely enjoys uh and we went there not too long ago just to kind of get away and uh celebrate some friends that have come to visit us so it was a definitely a nice experience it was in the heart of stone town we got to just kind of uh have that experience uh, it's a very nice restaurant, very clean, uh, very well kept. Uh, and sorry, guys, I know you'll hear uh, some of the background noise, but <laughs> as we continue on, this is just what it is here. So, babe, what did you think all about this restaurant? I actually loved the restaurant. The food was great. The atmosphere was nice. It was very clean. The service was great. I have zero complaints about this restaurant. Mm -hmm. I loved it. Very impressed with the present presentation. Uh, I think it was velvet, like placeholders, mm -hmm. and it was looked like gold silverware. <laughs> uh, it was very upscale to, you know, what we would normally eat out here, closer to the villages, closer to out out from the city, anyway. Um, and I think it was a, definitely a four-star restaurant here in Stone Town. Uh, yes, um, yes. And, and so can you tell us, I'll let my wife tell you all of the wonderful dishes that we had. Okay, so I won't get into who had what, but we ordered different things on the menu and we kind of tried them all. Um, one thing that we had was the chicken fried rice. It looked very delicious. Uh, we also ordered buttered chicken. We ordered butter naan. We ordered a spicy chicken dish with garlic naan. Um, a chicken salad sandwich and chips. We ordered the chicken tikka masala. And a few of us got the pineapple and mango smoothie. So overall, we had a good grasp of the menu with yes. this, uh, with this uh, excursion, uh, and the prices was wasn't very wasn't very bad at all. No. Uh, we definitely got a chance to really uh, share as a family because each of us, you know, we shared a little bit of our dish, uh, and and I think uh, overall it was it was very good. Everything was tasty. Um, how does this food kind of compare to some of the Indian places that you've been in America? Well, for me, because I love Indian and I know that's not a, a big thing for you. Um, the spice level for my butter chicken could have been a little bit more spicy. But your dish, the flavor for your dish was phenomenal. It was really good. The chicken tikka masala, the flavor for that one was very good. So what I did was I actually mixed a little bit of what he had, which was spicy, in with my butter chicken. It was it was very good that way. Mm -hmm. So according to the states, they usually ask you, what's your spice level? One to five or one to four? And we just told them, hey, make it spicy. So I guess we didn't specify how spicy. So next time I will specify. Yeah. Um, and, and so what would you what would you rate that as for a spice level? Would it be a one in your book? For me, I would probably rate it as probably a two. OK. Yeah. Yeah. And, and for my dish, what was it? For your dish, I would probably rate that maybe almost a four. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So, uh, like, again, mine was like a pepper chicken dish uh, that she mixed in uh, with hers. And um, so for you guys that may come here also, you know, 
that'll help you kind of navigate what your spice level might be. Because <laughs> uh, me, uh, I'm more of a Texas Pete kind of guy. Uh, I like that uh, vinegar-based hot sauce. But at the end of the day, as far as the actual uh, red pepper, all these types of spices, it's a little bit much for me. Uh, I like it a little bit, but for the Indian dishes, it's, it's kind of too heavy for me. So I'm a, I'm, I'm a light body when it comes to that. So I'm, I'm one, maybe two kind of guy. Uh, but overall, I, I do think it was uh, very good. Yeah. Um, me, only other place I've had, if you've heard of this restaurant in Virginia called Monsoon, that was something similar that I think we've, that I've had uh, to these dishes. Uh, and, and so, yeah, I, I don't see, you know, any comparison or any differences that would make you be like, oh, this is authentic, more more so authentic than the other. Uh, but yes, everything was pretty, pretty good. Mm -hmm. uh, it was definitely tasty. Uh, and I think we all enjoyed our time. Uh, so as far as the uh, clay pot restaurant, I think we will definitely taste it again. I definitely will. I might have to get a takeaway. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I will definitely taste it again. Yeah. Yes. So yeah, this is uh, definitely uh, was a blessing and we definitely want to thank our uh, friends and family that have come over to mm -hmm. enjoy some of this time with us. That was definitely a blessing as well. Um, so we're not going to hold you guys. Uh, I know I've spread some pictures throughout, uh, but as always, family, we appreciate you for listening and as always, enjoy the journey.